So today we're going to go over our final demonstration of our eddy current dyno. This is kind of what our final product looks like. We've got our chain guard, chain inside, fiberglass stator, student wound electromagnets. Here's our electrical box. We've got some MOSFETs connected to a heatsink. A couple of Arduinos hooked up for motor control and sensors. Power supply. With this demo, we're using an electric motor to run the dyno. We have our FuTech load cell hooked up to our stator for load readings and some disc brake rotors as our rotors. Here we have our graphical user interface. With this interface, we're able to control the motor, so long as it's an electric motor in this instance. And the load, for our load, it's going to be the electric coils. And we have the ability to watch the plot as we see a torque and RPM curve, and also save the plot. In this demo, we'll only be running the motor at full speed. We won't be controlling the motor. So we'll go ahead and start the demo. We've got the motor running at full speed. We can turn on our clock. And we're running at close to 250 RPM. We start at the load. We'll find that based on the duty cycle of our pulse width modulated electromagnets, you'll see the torque go up and the RPM slow down. And this is based on the FUTEC load cell that's been calibrated. And we can take it all the way up to max. And we're only running the dyno at half power, but even with half power, we're running about one and a half foot pounds of torque. We can let off on the load. And we find that it slows down. Once we stop the load, the dyno starts to run a lot faster, as you can hear in the demonstration. So all in all, this dyno project was a pretty big success for us as a senior design project. We're not totally done with it because we are looking to do a full engine test and you can expect to see some results from that shortly. But from here on, this is a good intermediate test and we'll be running smaller engine until we work up to the standard Formula SAE engine, which is rated to be about, about 60 horsepower. Thank you.